Okay, I want to do a geek out time with Tabor Cope. The thing I wanted to geek out for today was with my backpack. So this is my new backpack that I got a couple months ago. It's by a company called Peak Design. And um, I, what, a little backstory is, I've always looked at backpacks and thought they didn't ever do a good job of crossing over. You had backpacks that did a great job of being like good for school, so they could carry your laptop and your tablet and things like that, and carry books and binders and things. And then you had your backpacks that were really good for like carrying gear, like camera gear, and things like that, but there wasn't a good backpack that crossed over between the two, where what if you wanted to be able to carry books and laptops and things like that, but you also wanted to carry camera gear and lenses and things like that. And I always talked about how maybe one day I might do my own company where I made like the perfect backpack. Well, I came across this company, and this is now one of my favorite backpacks, and it's pretty darn close to like what I always envisioned. So, um, first of all, you've got <clears throat> the straps back here. You've got a collar strap that snaps out of the way, uh, but when you want to, you can unhook it and you can hook it onto this side, so that's really nice. And then there's uh, waist straps that are down in here that are hidden inside these pockets, these side pockets right here, and so you can pull out the waist strap and you can do uh, um, a waist to help out as well. Then as far as entry, we've got a rear entry right here along the top, and along here you've got uh, your compartment for your laptop and then you also got a pocket up along the top here where you can put uh, some keys or notes or you know things like that um, and there's like, two different pockets down inside here you can maybe see the divider so so that's pretty cool then as far as the main compartment then they've got a cool little magnetic latch design here where it not only latches but it's also got a magnet on it so that's nice and you've got a top entry here along the top of the backpack as well as a little pocket for putting things in there. But the hard part with top entry bags like this is, well, what if you want to get to something that's in the bottom of the bag? And that's something that's always hard. So with them, they have this ingenious idea where they've got these two side, side zippers. Um, here you obviously got the side pocket where you can put water bottles or you know any other things like that. Um, but they've got these straps here, this zipper here, that you can open up, and this opens up a whole side compartment into the bag. So here you can see from the top entry, I can get to it from the top, but then I can also get side entry. And so right now I've got loaded in all my different camera gear. So there's my external microphone, there's my DJI Osmo, and then here you can see they've got a lot of good um, dividers. And these dividers are great because they can pop in and out and make little compartments and things like that. So um, here is my drone that's in the top compartment there and then you can see I had these all um, popped up initially so I could put the Osmo something that was long and lengthy in the compartment but then I still get some horizontal separation here when I flop these down right. So in this compartment here this is the charging for the battery of the, the drone and then Here's an extra lens for the camera. And the cool part is, is you've, well, let me stay on this side. You've got your compartment here on this side where you can put all your different charging cables and a couple different pockets and things like that, right? So that's nice. Now I got the same thing on this side. So I can take this zipper here and open it up on this side. Here's for my Osmo Plus, right? Um, here's the controller for the drone. And now if I pop this down, you can see that I'm now lifted through the whole bag. Um, so here's my Canon Rebel um, with the lens there. Here's the base for the Osmo. And again, now I've got complete access all the way through the whole bag, which is really cool. And just on this side, then I've got this side pocket, which has got cables and straps and things like that. So that's really neat. And then as you're changing the things you're carrying, these dividers are all Velcro, so I can pull this out and you can see the different ways it can go in there and I can put this in in which way that I want depending on what I'm carrying. It's really easy to just put back in and out. So it's uh, now one of my favorite backpacks as you can see. Um, so the nice thing is that obviously if you're carrying it over your shoulder, you can sling it off on one side and kind of have it in front of you and you can zip this down and get side access to something in the bottom and then flip it up and then zip back up.
So that's really neat. The one nice other cool ending feature that I want to show is down here in the bottom of the bag. They've got a little pocket for these straps and these straps can come up here and they can loop onto one of these loops and you can tighten this down um, or you can cross the straps. So if you've got a jacket or something like that that uh, is kind of big and bulky and will fit inside your bag, then you can put it here and you can cross it with the straps and you can zip it down. So that's really neat. Um, additionally, they have these same straps here that come out of the side pocket. So then you can take this and you've got, they've got some more um, loops up here where you can do something around the side to keep something tall and the side pocket together. Or you can go from this point and you can come down and they've got loops down here where you can come down and you can, you know, have a mattress pad or something like that down here. So a lot of great options and uh, they've got nice uh, side handles. You can carry it that way as well. So yeah, I just wanted to kind of show this bag because I'm actually getting ready to go on a trip and so I've got to take this stuff out and put some different things in it. Um, but I feel like this is probably the best backpack that I've found that has neat, met the in-between phase where you can choose to configure it to hold like camera gear and kind of big square things and stuff. Or you can take out the dividers and you can put it in a way that you can carry books and laptops and things like that. So anyway, there's your geek time with Tabor Co. See you next.